hello all welcome to the 2022 art exhibition at sir peter blake art gallery dartford uh, so today we are going to see some fabulous artwork from the um, very talented and budding artist across the kent county so let's get started so the first one is of um, Uh, kind of an estuary i can say or maybe uh, some some kind of a beach work where i can see some tall rocks or buildings um and um, uh, some some waves hitting the shore uh, which is um, quite impressive now the second one is of a pattern uh, it 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 includes a lot of vibrant colors like violet purple and indigo and uh, pink uh, which is also quite attractive and um, definitely a masterpiece uh, by uh, the artist um okay the next one is of a a boat a boat yard i can say a dock where we can uh, see some boats are um uh, you know yeah, uh it's it been uh, parked and uh, the next one also um, is another boat yard definitely it takes a lot of time to bring the precision of this man made creations because it involves a lot of straight lines and i i really do understand the the time and the patience taken by this artist to bring in all those um, intrinsic uh, details into it it's uh, quite impressive and uh, very well done whoever has done it it's it's uh, marvelous 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 piece of artwork i would say and also the sky and the clouds brilliant um the next one is um, an expressionist i would say an abstract work uh, what i can infer is a um, sunset sky and also the ocean that's what i infer from that painting another one also um a same thing you know uh, of a of a dawn or a dusk um and the ocean and the shore uh which which is also quite um a fantastic um, artwork um and coming on to the next wall is a painting of a bird i suppose um and a very interesting intriguing um patterns uh, we can Uh, find from this one and i reckon a, a kingfisher bird or a lark uh, trying to catch a prey and uh, i i really loved the pastel uh, colors used in it and the next one is um uh, well it, it it's kind of a very realistic painting of a peacock um and um this is mine by the way and i have used uh, uh, acrylic paint for this and also some um very uh, pastel pink shades at the back um well i can't say um the, the pink is pastel because it's quite bright uh, and um, a, a landscape that's it <laughs> uh, but i took around 2 uh, to 3 days uh, to finish this artwork and it was a rush done um, and i'm not that happy uh, by the work by the way as any artist would see that you know they they always see the same i, I would say Uh, the next one is, i think um it uh, reminds me of ls lowry some of the pictures you know as uh, house in the moor some of the pictures you know he has done uh, this is a farmland in a house and this one is definitely a breathtaking one you know i just love the details in this the dragonfly and a moth i i suppose um and the details is simply amazing you know the the, the wings especially the the small wings of the dragonfly and also the the, the procession oh, the, the procession is amazing and the next one is um, uh, an aircraft it reminds me of the, the the evolution of the aircrafts over the time and quite a lot of uh, details of puma i suppose is jumping over its logo uh, as a logo and uh, definitely the shadow of the aircraft in it's it's definitely another brilliant artwork now this i would say as a, as a woman of flies or just like a lady of the flies as the album i remember uh, but uh, yeah, a lot of um, um, very interesting uh, picture definitely especially the expression of the lady and also these spiders or 
I don't know, is there some mosquitoes or some moths uh, going around? Uh, definitely mm, very interesting. And this one is, I feel it's very much relating to the present condition of all of us as like a woman indoors and kind of longing to go outside, you know, the, the expression in the eyes definitely it um, reveals a lot the longing uh, feeling of getting out of the house and just flying just going out and just exploring the outdoors and this one again is um, uh, I can say relate uh, to many other painters you know it's about some wild um, a lady in the in the forest or um, a jungle girl um, this is also very close to nature and uh, the, the colors use the, the white and the green everything very interesting and this one is again another picture which uh, draws anyone's attention as uh, two people um, and also the colors the very versatile uh, very bright and uh, very catchy colors uh, used for these two yin and yan um, okay and uh, this one is patterned it reminds me of jackson Pollock, of some abstract expressionist uh, uh, artworks um, and also it, it has some kind of very interesting patterns in it so i think that that's also um, brings a lot of attention and this one oh my god uh, it reminds me of the 2021 uh, belarus uh, european union border crisis you know where uh, where uh, many Im uh, you know uh, uh, in, in the immigration uh, process you know the migration you know a uh, lot of um, um, people were coming inside and, and the look of the father is definitely heart melting and the expression you know is simply amazing uh, it, it, it's very very uh, catchy painting indeed so that brings us to the end of uh, the 2022 painting exhibition i hope you all loved it and maybe more ideas would be coming in your head <laughs> Uh, more than mine so definitely please do comment them in the comment box below uh, thank you so much for watching i hope you liked um, all of the paintings which were watching i re really appreciate your time uh, so until we meet next time bye for now